Hey everybody, we're checking out Unconventional Warfare. This is going to be the part two video. Go check out the other one if you didn't see that one first, but I uh, just had to pause for a minute, so I'm going to do the part two. I don't know if we'll play this much longer, but uh, we were just kind of checking out this squad screen here. We've got different skills and stuff. Uh, she apparently has recon, basic info on target, detail info on the enemy. I don't know how to use this, or is this kind of a passive sort of thing? I don't know, they all have level one anyways. She's got this bandolier torso. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what... If there's anything I can do here. Right now it kind of seems like it's just giving me information. It doesn't really seem like I can even interact with it. Oh! Can click and drag those. click to consume. All right, he's full. Ah, we can equip these. Does that affect our speed or anything? Or is that just like a free thing? Because there's a slot open. It's nice that you can see it on the character. Um, for extra gears. Okay, so if I equip this, then I get an extra slot here. So that's why this is changing, because it gives me an extra slot. It also um, doesn't take up a slot here, so that's kind of nice. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I guess I'll just eat. Oh, I can't eat. Oh, I could eat for her, but... It's not working for this lady. I don't know why. Maybe because her health is full and this is supposed to be a health type of thing? I don't really... I guess we're just gonna click on March. Oh, okay. So there's this and then there's a exclamation. Let's pause, pause it. I think it does. Go back into here. Map. March. Oh, looks like we're loading. This is some kind of encounter or something. Oh, more story just says dot dot dot. We encountered a hostile force. All right, so I guess we gotta fight. Okay, how to play again? Okay. So, there's a truck. Is that. Parked, or is that gonna like drive at me or something? Let's see. Whoa. Oh, well, I unpaused it for just a moment and that kind of popped these guys into view, so that's kind of weird. I would expect that to kind of already be the state so that, you know, when I'm setting up my first actions, I would want to be able to see these guys. <clears throat> so there's th four people. And I guess we want to sneak up behind here or something. I guess maybe we could. So we can't travel over here or over here. Oh, that guy. I don't know how big these blow up. Maybe those can be. Something we utilize here. Guess we're just gonna... Oh, well I clicked on this, but only two of them are pathing over there, even though this guy's selected. That's kind of weird. Why isn't he... Maybe it's just not drawing... Oh, why aren't you... He doesn't want to move. He's stuck or something. I don't know what's his problem. Uh oh, not great. I don't know why you won't move. You guys got to get over here. Hopefully they don't like shoot each other if they're <laughs> one is in the way or something. He just does not want to move.
Well, everyone's dead, but I still can't move him, so I think I'm just gonna have to play this without him or something. That's not great, but he don't want to move. I don't know. No, I want to attack. Oh, I can't attack these. It shows it as red, but it won't, I guess maybe because I'm not close enough or something. Shoot over this. No, I don't want to move there. I want to attack. Blow these things up. Shoot it. Shoot it. I guess I can't actually shoot these or it's just showing red because it's telling me I can't go there. I think. Is that a weapon? Holy crap, what is all this stuff? Holy cow. That guy took a lot of shots. We must have... Oh, come on. I didn't want a victory yet. I wanted to go over here. Oh, I still can move. Can't even path over here. There's all those goodies. I want to pick those up. Apparently this is all out of bounds, off limits. Kind of annoying. Um, guess I can't actually attack these. All right, we're still going. I think we just want to keep marching here. It's another encounter. We've encountered a hostile force. All right. Hopefully, nope, he still won't move. What the heck is the problem? Did he eat too much? Get shot in the leg? All right, so I can see a red thing there. I guess I got to unpause it and pause it again. Yeah, <laughs> makes these pop up for some reason. Oh, all sorts of dudes up there. That's a pile of sand or something. But I guess I'm just gonna You need to be facing this way, at least. Don't think maybe she can kinda use this. All right, so those two can see. Oh, that looks like we got it then. Holy cow. So many shots just not landing here. That's weird. It's really weird when we shoot at one guy for like a minute straight and then he finally dies and then this guy dies in one shot. Weird how that happens. All right. Um, maybe we want to go over here. They're all facing that way, so it's easy to kind of ambush them if they don't move. This looks like the only thing we can shoot over that we can use as cover. Sort of like over here. Well, let's go up here. Are they pathing in that way?
So there was a moment there where I clicked on this and she, it looked like she pathed over, but she just kind of stayed still. I don't know if it's because it, it was like somehow invalid for her or something. But I had to send that command again. It was a little weird. Looks like they can shoot over this thing. I don't know. Oops, I'll go the other way. And can't get quite close here, but this does kind of look like it would block them almost. But apparently it doesn't. I don't know. I don't know if the amount of stuff between you and the target has an effect on your accuracy. It looks like he died in one shot there. So the ding sound, I don't know what that is. I thought it was kind of like a hit a hit sound, but I hit these guys and it, it didn't, and it didn't ding. So I don't know what it means. I could conceive it was like a critical hit or something like that. Um, it, does, it seems to be, there's a bit of a visual seam around the edge here. I think you can probably see in the capture. But yeah, if that's supposed to be like a critical hit, it seems like it, it's... There were times when it happened like too many times in a row or something, so... Full. Full. Five out of five. Yeah, so I'm hoping like if they're full of food, then that means they recharge their health or something. That effect. Yeah. Oh. She just totally bumped up. All right, so I think we got to where we were going here. We're almost out of this, out of this town area. Across this field is our best bet to escape. We'll be in the, op in the open and is most likely to be heavy, heavily guarded. So that's not really a correct sentence, I don't think. Here we go. <clears throat> right. He is still not working. His legs don't work. Are we supposed to go this way? It's actually not really clear at this point because there's space down here. Can I go this way? Apparently this isn't even the map, so that's not really clear to me. Um, in other cases, it seems like it just kind of went off into black, but it's like we can go here. We can't go here. So that's kind of a, that's like a plateau or something. I think we're supposed to go this way because this is where the camera was facing originally. Eliminate all enemies, there's 13 of them. Oh crap. <laughs> That's not a... What are we supposed to do? The heck? Look at all these guys. Is this... Do we just go to our death here? The heck? Anyone. All right, so we can move and attack the same. Okay, I guess we just won. <laughs> All right, well, seemed like the odds were against us there, but we just kind of went and shot everyone. Didn't really do any tactics, but to be continued. All right, end of demo. Thanks for playing, you're welcome. All right. So that was the demo. Um, it's pretty cool so far. Um, it's definitely, you know, shows a lot of potential. I think just right now I'm kind of wondering what the, the sort of tactical type of stuff we're supposed to be doing is. I don't really know what to do besides try to get behind cover or um <laughs> you know just line up your guys and go shoot people you know have everyone shoot at the guy at the same time that sort of thing uh 
so yeah, I'd, I'd be interested to see kind of what, what more you have planned for the different tactical things that you can do. Um, it might be nice if there was some kind of indication of like when you're behind cover versus like cover you can shoot over versus cover that you can't kind of thing. Maybe you can use like a different color in drawing the arcs or something like that. Uh, might give a little better indication for when those sort of bonuses kick in and stuff like that. But um, yeah, I mentioned a few things. I think I think it'd be really nice if you could spin the camera around with the mouse. And uh, aside from that, I think I'll probably mentioned everything I thought of as I saw it. So hopefully that's helpful to you. And I'll see you guys in the next video.